It's Sway in the Morning, only on Shade 45. Sway in the Morning, Shade 45, 35 minutes into the hour. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they approached me and said, hey, man, how you feel about having Ted Allen on the show? As soon as they said his name, we just heard these voices. <laughs> I said, uh, how could I say no to Ted Allen? You know, I'm a Chops fan. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, you know, sir. I want to know what's in the basket so I can learn how to pro- pro- produ- produce a meal. There's you know some I mean? bad stuff in those baskets. Yes. Yeah, there really man. is. That's such a great concept, though. Who came up with that? Uh, my dear friend, Linda Lee, who was a an executive producer on Queer Eye, uh-huh. had this idea for this show. And uh, I got to tell you, it started out very, very differently. They shot the first pilot, and I was not involved. Uh-huh. The show was set at a mansion in New Jersey. The chefs arrived in limousines. Uh-huh. The host was the butler of the mansion, wearing a tuxedo, holding a chihuahua. I'm not even kidding. Oh, really? And every time a sh- uh, someone got chopped, they fed the dish <laughs> to the chihuahua. Oh. Which is problematic wow. in all sorts of ways. Yeah. And Food Network saw that pilot and they said, oh, I, I don't know about this. Yeah, right. <laughs> How about those starving kids in Africa? You know what I mean? You get PETA up in your face oh on that one. Oh, my right, God. Right, right. So gl- luckily, y'all tweaked that concept, right? Stri- but- stripped it down, made uh-huh. it simple. The, the What I like about this show, what I love about this show, is uh-huh. that it's very, very straightforward. It's all about the food. There's no re- reality stuff. There's mm-hmm. no drinking. There's no hooking up. There, we got other shows for that. Yeah. This is can, simply, can you cook these four ingredients into something nice in 20 minutes or not? And if you can't, see ya. Wow. Just like that. Yeah. Now, let me ask you this because, you know, I know it's television and a lot of times you kind of got to play along with things. Have you ever tasted something that was just so horrible that you almost wanted to vomit? Yes. Really? Absolutely. But the the great thing uh, about my job is I'm just the host of the show, so I don't have to eat all this stuff. Uh-huh. Right. Um, and I will say, often, they come up with something that's delicious, that's amazing. And, you know, people think the baskets are random, yeah. but they're really not. They right. ha- they have a plan. They, 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 they say, okay, we'll give you tofu, flatbread, and... Uh, um, tomatillos, and uh-huh. we're thinking about grilled cheese and tomato soup. Yeah, we're thinking do a variation on that, a riff on that. Uh-huh. Once in a while they get it, but man, twenty minutes—that's tough. That's it's tough. hard. It's hard. It's quick, right? Hard. Has, has other chefs made? something with the baskets is that where the idea comes from like has another chef made the dish and then you try to test how does it work because i don't understand like okay we have cream corn uh cheese puffs and black chicken Uh i'm like who is gonna make you know has someone else done it uh, they, they don't have to, well, the, the baskets come from Food Network's culinary department, which is, has a staff of chefs okay. and the, that's led by a guy named Rob Blyfer. Uh, they don't have to, I don't think they actually go and cook it because we're, we're moving too fast. They just oh. have to talk it through, which by the way, is much easier than cooking with a can of cream corn and black chicken. Black right. chicken is, you know, that's a chicken that's, that's a very old scrawny, that's a bird that you make stock with and that's it. You don't why, want to. Why the black chicken got to be old as <laughs> I know, I know. I don't get that, man. You know, is that Discrimination, even in the poultry field. Even in the poultry yeah. field. Yeah. Damn. All it's right. Bad. All right. <laughs> Ted Allen Let's is get here. Cornell West into this situation I know, man. somehow. Where is Cornell? It's Sway in the morning. Only on Shade 45.